Anna, my daughter, the year we spent on the road gave me time to think about things. Respect, responsibilities, duties. They all mean nothing compared to what's important. My family, you. I'm sorry, I only got it now. I'll go through this snow-covered graveyard with a sieve, if that's what it takes to find the cure. As for Artyom, he feels his guilt. He wants to atone. I'll just have to see that atonement doesn't cost him his life. The important part is that I'm back in Metro, and no mutant can stop me here. Radiation on the surface is different, though. Frankly, I thought I was buying a one-way ticket for myself going in. You said you were close, but why do you need the Institute? You are persistent. We're on a mission, but that's all I can tell. But now, thanks to the green stuff given to us by Kirill, we both have a chance to achieve the goal and survive. So, Private, Artyom left. I'd better get ready to set out too. What about me, Colonel, sir? You'll stay here. I'm putting you in charge of communications. I need someone to coordinate the operation. Can you handle the responsibility? Yes, sir. I can. Good. Uh, by the way, Private, how did you live here before the riots, when there was still enough green stuff to go around? Uh, we did all right. But my dad was always out on a mission or a patrol. So you barely saw him? Oh, no. Dad did his best to come home earlier, especially on the holidays. We even spent the last New Year's together. Colonel, sir, the maintenance guys asked to remind you to burn all the slime around the pumps once you reach them. Uh oh, I say the slime is done for. Colonel Klebnikov himself is taking up the flame. <laughs> or where is it? Here you go, Colonel, sir. Mind you, it's quite heavy. I know. Is it pressurized? It should be, but I'll still check. The handle's on the side. Give it a pump or two if needed. Ah, uh, if you want something done, you have to do it yourself. <laughs> All right, I'm off. Give Slime some hell, too. We'll do just that, sir. We certainly will. Break a leg. Break both. Oh, thanks. Older to all groups. I just saw a fully grown worm, so watch out. Older, red one here. Roger that. Red two, Roger. Red three, Roger that, sir. Good.
Sir, this is Red 3. I got a first pipe here. Can't burn through a barricade. We're gonna need some explosives. Red 3, you don't need explosives. Just find the valve that stops the water flow. Roger that, Alder. Red 3, I found the valve and then proceeding as planned. Good job, Red 3. <coughs>
lost pretty much. What's up with you? Oh, my flame won't hold the pressure. And I can't find a leak for the life of me. Do you have any spare fuel? I didn't expect that shit to grow so thick here. Of course I do, sir. Help yourself. Here. Nice. Thank you. I heard helping the commanding officers is good for your career. Also, that shit did grow like crazy. Ah, I think I got it. <laughs> I really did. All right, I'll go catch up with the guys. Good hunting, sir. You too.
out the Oscom beak we gave him, huh? And you can see it by his walk and the way his pants still smoked. So he calls me over and he says, I don't care how you do it, but the pumps must work. So I say, where am I supposed to get the O-rings? The slime just rots them and the pumps break down. And he just says he don't give a fuck. Can you imagine such an asshole? And I just go, so, are you telling me to steal them from another station? You know as well as I do, they don't make them no more. Or, or do you think I'll just shoot all my green stuff at once and go topside to get it? You want the results, you either get me the parts or go... Uh, well, I told him to fuck himself. So he just turns all red and shouts, no green stuff for you this month. And I go, really? Then I'm doing no work this month. Fix the pumps yourself, you asshole. So that was it for that job.
At ease, gentlemen. You did a great job there. Thank you, Colonel, sir. Frankly, we were on sweep-up duty after you, sir. Ah, cut that. Sweep-up duty. Sure. <laughs> on behalf of OSCOM, I'm issuing an official commendation. We serve OSCOM. <laughs> great. We'll get out of those suits and go rest. Certainly, sir. Thank you, sir. Sir, take that suit off and put the flamer down, please. They have to be scrubbed for radiation. You'll also be getting a shot of green stuff at the checkpoint. I'll call them. You just took a week's worth of exposure, at least. Good. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, and goodbye, Colonel Sir. Come aboard, Colonel Sir. Thank you. Hey, guys, get aboard. We give you lift to prospect. Thank you, sir, but we're waiting for the transport from HQ. There's enough space for everyone. Good luck, then. Let's go, Petrovich. Yes, sir. <laughs> your sleeve, please. We've got to give you the shot. Here you go. Roll your sleeve up, Petrovich. You get a shot, too. Hey, uh, uh, no. Please, I'd rather use my own injector at home. Be my guest, then. Thank you. Uh, don't lean on the doors, please. Next station is Krasne Prospect. <laughs> Granddaughter getting worse? No, thank God. Still, standard child's allowance of green stuff is not enough for her, even though we moved to the prospect. So I'm squirreling away whatever I can, just in case. It's not easy, but we survive, and that's what counts. Yeah, but enough about us. <laughs> Tell me if you roasted that shit good. That we did, Petrovich. That we did. Ha! <laughs> uh, my friend, that is good to hear. Still, it will just grow even thicker next time. Like it always does. And see, the pumps are failing. It's because of that slime. And they've been working non-stop for 20 years. Oh, and now this shit. The filters get clogged, the O-rings, they burst, the iron rusts. 
As soon the whole counterfeiting system will give up the ghost, and <laughs> you'll have the robots here. <laughs> You'd make a good gondolier. <laughs> I can sing too. Hello. Please spare me. Your singing is an atrocity. Please proceed. The general is expecting you. I don't need your excuses, Captain. If you take the initiative to do something, you must be ready to see the thing you started to the end. Dismissed. Sir, yes, sir! Oh, Slava! I've been waiting for you. Come on in. Make yourself comfy. There's been a new development here while you were out barbecuing. Take a look at these maps. Background radiation? Yes. Stalkers brought this in from the SATCOM center. And now, I want your people to go there and find the fresh ones. Detailing the whole country so that we know where to go. Take this under personal control and ensure complete secrecy. Okay? Go, Tolia. Cut to the chase. Are we preparing an evacuation? All right. This is strictly between us, mind you. Yes. We can't delay any longer. We're out of green stuff. We'll have to resort to confiscations, so everything must stay under wraps for now. Why the secrecy? It's good news. People would donate their stock voluntarily if we told them. Not my decision, Slava. Still, sometimes it makes sense to save the good news for last. I see. Thanks for telling me. Remember, it's between us. You know me. Well, Happy New Year! Uh, wait a second. Better get home now. As a hero of the war on slime and a lone father, you are hereby granted a New Year's present from the command. A one-month allowance would do. <laughs> Thanks. I won't hold you any longer, unless... How about some tea? Slava, I'm sorry I kept you here. Go. Go see your son. Give my regards to Kirill and a Happy New Year. I'll be working on my speech in the meantime. Hate making public addresses, but the occasion calls for it. Dear citizens of Krasny Prospect and our guests from others. Colonel, sir. Hello, Colonel, sir. A happy new year to you. Happy New Year. On duty tonight, I feel for you. Hello, sir. There's too many people in the way. You can't really go through. You'd better go up through the restaurant and get to the gallery from there. Thanks. Happy New Year. Same to you, Colonel, sir. You filthy drunkard! Just look at yourself, you pig! Look, Tanya, I just... So this is the new year. Your children have nothing to eat, and you drink your wages away. Oh, come on, Tanya. Got it. We are celebrating here. Come join us, sir. Carry on. I'm going home. Happy New Year. Thank you, Colonel, sir. Give our regards to Kirill. Thank you. Happy New Year, sir. Happy New Year, Colonel Klebnikov. Same to you, Misha. How about a drink? The first one is on the house tonight. Uh, tempting, but no thanks. Suit yourself. You could drop by later once you put your kit to sleep. Look, 
One day, we are going to go outside, are we not? We are not moles to live out our lives underground, you know. Ha <laughs> ha! What a surprise! Drink to the new year with us, Colonel Sir! Hello, sir! Join us, please! We'd be happy! Uh, sorry guys, but I gotta get home see my son. Happy New Year to you all! Ah, thank you, sir! Thank you, Happy sir! Happy New Year! Let me at least hug you. Not now, look! There's people around. Oh, come on. I bet you didn't expect an ambush here. <laughs> <laughs> Great disguise, Private. Don't... The prayer to celebration is almost accomplished. There's just one light bulb remaining, sir. At ease, Private. I'll help you. Happy New Year, Dad. I didn't think you'd make it in time. You were late for my birthday. And Mom's anniversary, too. You see... I was just doing my best to make sure there were as few sad anniversaries in other families as possible. Oh, I understand. Good to hear that. Now, turn it on! Mission accomplished! Good job, Private! Thank you! Oh, Dad, I have something for you. Here, Petrovich helped me fix it. Oh, thank you, son. Speaking of Petrovich, as soon as the official celebration is over, all personnel are to wash their faces and arrive at Petrovich's place wearing dress uniform. Yay! Arrive at Petrovich's clean face in that corona, sir. Wow, the tree is so beautiful. Yes, listen. Dear citizens of Krasny Prospect, and our guests from other stations. Year 2034 is almost over. It wasn't an easy year, but all the hardship only served to make us close our ranks around our common goal. The well-being of everyone living down here in the tunnels. We are all looking forward to the coming year, expecting change for the better, and it is sure to arrive to our concerted effort as a community. On behalf of OSCOM leadership, I thank you all for your good work and wish you a Happy New Year! Happy 2035! 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1! Happy New Year!